Welcome to 85, it's James. <laughs> In today's video, we're gonna show you how to open up our containers. Let's start off by showing you our containers. This is a 10 pounder. This one right here is a 25 pounder. This one down here is a 100 pounder. This is a 200 pounder and that's a 400 pounder. That one's a 400 pounder too, thanks James. <laughs> What we used to open up our containers is called a bung wrench like this one. Or you can get a smaller version like this one. It has the same thing, so open it up. We'll put the description below so you guys can purchase it if you want. First, you're gonna wanna cut out the safety seal. And as you can tell, Rambo is James' role model. Right, James? <laughs> Using a Rambo knife or a pair of scissors, you're gonna wanna cut out these four tabs. Notice there'll be a black cap. Using a screwdriver, because you do not want to pierce or puncture the expandable spout, you're going to pull the black tabs up. Squeeze both tabs together and pull towards yourself. Now you can unscrew the cap. Now you can pull off the inner safety seal. Be careful when popping it open. You don't want to spill it all over the place. <laughs> now you can directly pour out of the pail. When finished, screw the black cap back on. And voila! safe to store <laughs> and you open up the 25 pound the same way now moving on to the 100 pound drum you see we have a 2 inch bun and we have a 3 quarter inch bun and we're going to show you how you can add this spout directly onto the container to make pouring a lot more easier for you guys <laughs> using the tab on the bunk wrench you're going to want to put it into the slit and unscrew the 3 quarter inch bun this is threaded so you guys can add the 3 quarter inch spout directly onto the container. We will put it on the description below where you guys can purchase one. Also, do not over tighten it. You don't want to strip it out. On a 200 pound drum, you have two 2 inch buns. You don't have a 3 quarter inch bun. And we're going to show you why. Using your handy dandy bun wrench, you're going to want to unscrew the 2 inch bun. On the two inch buns, you have to cut out three quarter inches so you can add the spout, which James will show you with his Rambo knife. <laughs> We're trained professionals, we make it look easy. <laughs> Perfectly cut out beautifully. Maybe that Rambo knife does make a difference, huh James? <laughs> now you're gonna want to screw the bun back onto the drum and make sure it's on there pretty tight. Now you're gonna want to screw on the three inch spout and line it up so when you pour it, it pours directly out. Just like this. Now once again, using your handy dandy bung wrench, you're going to want to unscrew the other 2 inch bung. And this right here ladies and gentlemen, is a 2 inch spout. Which isn't necessary, only if you like showing off. <laughs> bigger spout, bigger pour, just like this. Thank you for watching, we hope you enjoy- James, James close the spout, close the spout man! <laughs> Thank you for watching, we hope you enjoyed this video. And remember, here at AFI, we show you how to open up our containers. <laughs>